Good morning, Creative Tribe. My name is Pauline Dugald and I'm an artist and a creative. And I spent a lot of years repressing my inner artist. This is my art behind. I paint. I paint with oil and various medias, but for many, many years I did not express my artistic side. And now I help other creative individuals who are also stuck in that regard, help them overcome resistance and help them learn to become better creatives. And in this video, I want to talk about the subject of fear. Because as creatives, we are in a way predestined to be on the cutting edge of progress, to be on the forefront of the unknown. And I often listen to Jordan Peterson, and he has this quote that I love very much. And he says that you have to fight the dragons that guard the gate to that which you desire the most, or that which carries the most gold. And I love this quote because the things that we want the most are locked behind the doors that are guarded with these dragons that are our fear, representation of our fear. And you can look at it both ways. You can either fight those dragons or you can pet those dragons. It's up to you. You can resist them, you can fight them, you can see the world and life as a battlefield, or you can embrace them and make them your friends. It's all up to you and it's all up to, it's your own choice how to perceive that reality in front of you. But fears play a critical role in our exploration of the unknown as creatives. Because as we are looking, I like this another quote that I heard somewhere, if you look into the abyss, abyss starts to look back at you. When we are faced with the unknown, the essence of that which makes creation possible, a lot of things come up that our small egos don't know how to deal with. Our personalities, our ego constructs, they are rather limited because they are based in this reality. And everything that we are trying to create is based on the other side of this reality, uh, other side of this three-dimensional physical material world. So when we are going out there and drawing from that void, from that abyss, those ideas that are coming to us, we have to face the things that are not part of our current system, our current mindset, current reality. There is always expansion happening and our charge as creatives is to continue to expand. And those fears play a critical role because they show us where to look in order to expand more. They are also sort of like signposts. And I want you to think about this in this way. At the end of life, when you are finished with this game or whatever you want to call it, with this performance in the movie of your life, when you're finished with that and you are faced with the results of your life and maybe a creator, whatever you want to believe and how you, however you want to perceive the end of your life, and you consider what was at stake, what were you trying to achieve, what were you trying to bring in, what was your purpose as a creative? If your purpose as a creative was to bring forward the unknown and all, and all the time you spent was worrying about the fears that were affecting the small ego part of yourself and you wrapped up yourselves in dramas about those fears and you focused so much and diverted so much energy to those things, you resisted those dragons, you fought them hard, they were relentless and you spent a lot of your energy and maybe your potential was not expressed because of that. Now, on the opposite side, what you can do is that you can hug those dragons. You can accept them for what they are. You can make them part of your reality. Make them friends for you. And then divert all your energy towards exploration of the new ideas. Towards bringing something new. Towards creating. Towards being that person that makes unknown into the known. So that is my message for today. And there is, I wanted to let you know that I'm working on this exciting project. I'm working on the group workshop for creatives to help you overcome those fears or learn to 
deal with them better and overcome resistance in creativity. This workshop is in development. It is still under works and I'm creating it as I speak. But if you want to be on the waiting list, if it is something that interests you, click the link below and sign up for that. I will send you updates. I will keep you posted and even ask for your input so you can be part of the creation of this group endeavor. So if this was helpful, please like this video, subscribe. It always helps to share this idea, share this with others who might benefit from that as well and sign up for that waiting list so that when the moment comes and the workshop is ready, you'll know firsthand. It was great talking to you today. Take care, fight those dragons or hug them and we'll see you next time. Bye.